This is the Rowans in Sunbury, three bedroom semi-detached house. Really nice, quiet residential cul-de-sac here. Not too far from Sunbury train station. Equally, Feltham's not too far down the road either. As you can see here to the front, ample off-street parking. Got driveway leading to garage. Easily comfortable enough space there for two cars. That's without adopting the front garden there. If you felt like you wanted some further parking, but equally the road, as I mentioned, is, is quiet. So there's sufficient space if you had guests or visitors over to probably park on the road if you chose to. Front entrance hallway here opens into a small entrance room, space for your coats and shoes as you can see. Ground floor cloakroom, which is always convenient. And then we have a nice big open plan reception room here. It's not gonna quite do it justice, but actually nice big room, ample space for almost a sitting area and a dining area to the rear looking out into the garden. Turn around just to give you a bit more perspective. So that's kind of your seating area there. Nice and bright in here. Lots of light coming in from both sides. So nice bright airy feel to it. Got a little bit of storage under the stairs there. Cleverly decorated by the owners, but good deep storage cupboard. I mentioned that's the back section. So these guys have got quite a large dining room table here. So four seats and a bench on this side. So if you have got a big dining room, so there's more than enough space there. Kitchen position just off the dining area. You'll see we've got a cooker here, washing machine, we have a dishwasher just next to the fridge. Nice clean finish in here. Big window looking out onto the garden, which is quite pleasant. Come back to the garden shortly. I'll take you up onto the first floor. Again, lots of light pouring in as soon as you come up the stairs, you can see there. Lovely modern fitted bathroom suite. This has all been recently done. Heated towel out, new sink and toilet. And then we have the rainfall shower fitting above the bath there. Again, just really taste nice clean finish throughout this property. The master bedroom to the front. Try and give you a bit of scale again on this one. See, a double bed there, bedside tables to either side. Space for TV up on the wall. Then round to this side, looking at the other corner of the room. As you'll see we've got sliding glass doors there, mirror doors for the fitted wardrobe. So there's plenty of space in here for your bed, your normal bedside tables. Obviously with the fitted wardrobes there, you won't need to bring your own. But real nice main bedroom to the front of the property. Bedroom number two is another good double bedroom. Again, you'll see just lots of light pouring into this property. Space to walk around both sides of the bed comfortably. The owners have opted for a freestanding wardrobe on this side, but there's still space for more bedroom furnishings if you have them. Bedside tables comfortably, perhaps another chest of drawers. Bedroom number three is currently being used as a dressing room. When these guys brought this property, there was a double bed that used to occupy this space. But ac actually, you know, we're talking about a family home here. This is more than sufficient for a single bed, fit quite comfortably in there, either along either wall, maybe under the window if you chose to. But for these guys, this is their dressing room. Storage cupboard on the landing here, and the boiler's occupied. Space for your hoover and whatnot. Just a good storage cupboard. Give you the view into the lounge from the stairs here. Let's see. So double doors, quite wide double doors actually. They both open up. Looking out into the garden. Sort of well appointed patio area here. Recently updated garden as well. So you've got that raised decking area to the back section. As you can see, is a little sun trap for the latter part of the afternoon. Hence the barbecue and seating area there. 
but small lawned area yeah. leading through into what used to be the garage which has been cleverly converted now by the current owners during the current pandemic to have a nice home office environment here as you can see they've got a little bit of storage from shelving units space for your work computers etc but lots of room